Hi guys, I wanted to go over our schedule for the next five weeks, uh, leading up to the AP exam on May 12th, <clears throat> excuse me, I am going to have for you guys, for your learning pleasure, <laughs> one quiz and one uh, free response uh, problem assignment due each Friday. So they're b the ones for this week are available now. And I'm not going to show you the assignments or the quiz. I'm just going to briefly tell you the topics that are going to be on them so you guys can prepare. So if you go to assignments uh, and click on that, you will see it. I have it right here. And you'll see uh, first AP free response questions. And then it will be a second, third, fourth, and fifth as we go through the next the month of April. Uh, but this is very important to read this because I want you to make sure that you find a quiet place and do this assignment alone with no assistance. And I stress that, no assistance. Uh, do not look up the answers on online. Uh, do not look them up in your book. Do not look them up anywhere. Uh, answer them from what you have in your head. Create for, for yourself as much as possible an actual exam environment. This is a timed exercise. Once you click on the link right here, uh, the clock will start, and you'll have one hour to do five free response questions. You will not have to draw graphs, because I just couldn't figure out any way for you to be able to do that. You'll just simply type in uh, your answers, so they're basically, you know, they're basically essay type questions, essay type. So anyway. Um, so I'm just going to show you this real quick. If you click on this, you'll see this page will come up, warning you that you know once you will begin, uh, you will have uh, one hour, and so you'll just click on the begin. And the topics that you're going to want to review are um, well. The first question uh, shows a, a graph of a country that is engaging in international trade. So you're going to need to be very clear on what's going on there. The second question shows a graph uh, of a uh, of of the production of a good that is creating an externality, uh, and it's, and you're going to need to, to be a fam a familiar with how marginal social cost, marginal private cost, marginal social benefit, and marginal uh, private benefit works and answer questions about that. The uh, third problem shows a firm short run production function in a table. So you're going to need to be uh, familiar with um, marginal uh, uh, revenue product, wage prices. The fourth problem, I can find it here, is... Um, has to do with curves, where you're going to be identifying curves. I, I believe at least two of these you've done before. So you're going to need to understand cost curves and uh, what what they look like, why, why they look the way they look, in, in other words, why they're shaped the way they're shaped, and why the marginal cost curve intersects the other cost curves where it does. The fifth problem, you're going to be looking at a monopoly firm. I'm actually going to give you three graphs that look very similar, and you'll choose the one where you'll read a uh, short a scenario and then just choose the, the graph that the uh, scenario most accurately describes and then answer a questions about the monopoly firm. Okay, that's going to be your, uh, f your uh, first... AP, let me just scroll down here so you can see if I can scroll down. Can I scroll down? No, I can't. So uh, this is your first um, uh, AP free response of questions assignment, and it's due Friday at midnight. And let me just say, once again, no assistance. Don't look up the answers. I, want, I really need to know what you guys know on your own, uh, and you need to know. What you, what you can do on your own without help from anyone. 